It's personal between me you, and I'm going to do you some serious harm, you big stiff idiot. Okay. All right, Brandon Taylor here at True School Sports. I'm with the one and only. Let's go, Shannon champ. Shannon and Kenneth Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's good, champ? I heard, I'm chilling, champ. You're starting to get a little lively. When you first walked in, I saw you earlier. I was like, man, oh, my, my friend said he's a little quiet. I said he won't be, he won't be quiet when Trevor gets here. Nah, yeah. nah, I'm chilling. I'm just here, you know, with the people and everything. Entertaining, having a good time with the friends and family. Let's go, champ. Yeah. How do you, how do you feel about Dubois versus Trevor Bryan? Because a lot of people aren't giving Trevor Bryan a chance. I believe he's a 7-1 to underdog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to win tonight. Yeah. I'm hoping not because, you know, I'm with him. That's my boy. I want him to win tonight. Hopefully he'll pull it through. It's going to be a tough one, but uh, he here to work. So he's going to want to keep that title. Yeah. I know you're in a stoop boxing mind. Uh, what, what, what do you make of Daniel Dubois as a fighter? Ooh, tough fighter. Tough fighter. Got one loss against the juggernaut, which you can't really cut that Kind of, you know, because that's that's the juggernaut. The juggernaut is a beast, man. I find anybody, you know, it's real hard to beat him, let alone, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, you know, he had that one loss, but he is a tough fighter. He's going to have a great fight. Okay. I know uh, you're big on AJ's too. You know, he had that loss to Usyk, and now yeah. he's going to fight him again. Uh, first of all, what did you make of that, and, and how do you feel about him going against the Uh, uh Well, I thought, you know, it's a tough fight going in with Usyk. Usyk is a one of, like, one of a kind fighter, southpaw, and you know, an unreal conditioning uh you know iq boxing high iq just real hard to stay with him uh that's a tough fight man he's one of the best heavyweights of our era as well let alone uh and joshua what he's done in his short career um you know just two great fighters good fighters real good fighters man he's a he's a real fast athletic heavyweight Usyk. And, and in your day you were kind of a fast you, you were an, a fast athletic heavyweight how do you how do you beat a guy like that a guy like Usyk? you know who's so well schooled and so athletic you know the ring it's unbelievable, man. A heavyweight fighting like that, a southpaw heavyweight fight like that, reminds me a lot of Corey Sanders, but with more more skills. You know, the, the, the rest of the piece of Corey Sanders, South African heavyweight, was a tremendous puncher. You know, he knocked out Klitschko. And this guy, he, he's a southpaw. He, he, he can punch from a lot of different angles. His stamina is unreal. How do you beat a guy like that? You got to bang out. You got to fight. Who knows? I don't even know, yeah. Tim. It's hard to say. Tough one. Yeah. Tough one. I know you're like, um, I heard you heard an interview with you one time. You were talking about Tony Tubbs, how much you love Tony Tubbs. Ooh, Tony I, Tubbs. I, I wanted to kind of pick your brain about Tony Tubbs. Why, why do you love Tony Tubbs so much? That jab. He had a nice jab. He had a nice smooth walk around style. He just was walking with that. He was just walking. He wasn't even doing no bouncing. Just walking with that jab. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, and I, I could definitely tell from when, like, when you were fighting, and definitely when I saw you train at the heavyweight factory back in the day, you used to have that fluidity, that looseness to your to your own style. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. You know what? I mean, heavyweights are bigger nowadays. They got bigger, so it's a different era. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's a much, much different era. Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I've interviewed a ton of times, but like, I never asked you about uh, Felix Savone and uh, fighting him. What, what, what was that like back in the day, fighting Felix Savone? Scary. Yeah, <laughs> I'm going up against a machine. I was a kid going up against a grown man, but you know, I had to do what I had to do and confront that and go in there and try. I tried to knock him out, but he got me first. Let's go, champ. Yeah. What about, you fought Hoy, did you fight Hoy Luis Gonzalez? Or was nah, that I'd before? have knocked him out. That was before. That was yeah, before. I'd have knocked him out. <laughs> Let's go, champ. Okay, Shannon, well, I don't want to hold you up much longer, champ, but uh, any any final message you want to give to the boxing world about what you got going on? Nah, I'll be think? fighting in August, man. You're going to see me the return of the champ. Yeah, fight. Boxing? That's right. For Let's real? go, champ. Okay. Yeah, August 6th. It. August the 6th. Return of the champ. The return of the champ. Che Thank you for watching another video on True School Sports, the home of boxing. If you made it this far, do me a favor and do yourself a damn favor. Hit that subscribe button and surely you will not be disappointed. You know, True School Sports bringing you the latest and greatest, the untouchable, you know, boxing content, interviews, news videos, breakdowns, live fight reaction extravaganza. We've got a great community of, of people here, boxing fans all over the world from America to the UK to Australia and on and on and on. So join the empire today. Hit that subscribe button. Take care and God.